A short introduction, this is an action film scene, followed and hunted is James Bond. The hunter is Olga Kalashnikova, an enemy special agent. She wants to get the world happiness chip which Bond holds in his hands. And now the main points are told, let's begin with the story. In the very beginning Bond outwits Kalashnikova just by using his feet. Q had given him an extremely remarkable vehicle, on this he will carry out his world happiness chip mission. While Kalashnikova learns that even special agents can fail in the rush hour, Bond is on his way. And a little later he makes totally different experiences in the rush hour than Kalashnikova. In the meantime she doesn't get very far, which is rather frustrating for a special agent. In contrast to her, Bond is enjoying his journey on the 600 km long cycle path of Bremen with all its advantages. But suddenly Kalashnikova is in luck and a few moments later the two agents come dangerously close to each other. Good luck that bike riding agents in Bremen are entitled to use one-way streets in contraflow direction. Bond enjoys this and becomes rather high-spirited. Some minutes later, Kalashnikova gets a nasty special weapon. Unnecessary. She doesn't know where Bond is hiding. In this moment, he has a meeting with Q and gets a quite ordinary apple. He doesn't need a weapon as he has his bike. Meanwhile, Kalashnikova is screaming action hunt daydreams, a cold comfort. Bond realizes he needs a car to reach the secret meeting point, but that's no problem at all for the British top agent, because he has the license to car sharing. With AutoCard and PIN he gets easily and conveniently one of the 100 car sharing cars in Bremen, by the way, as also 3500 Bremer non-agents. A short time later, James Bond is 70 kilometers away in the beautiful green countryside. At the secret meeting point, Bond hands over the world happiness chip, so the happiness in the world is saved. Kalashnikova has completely lost control of herself. She had lost Bond and she will be in big trouble and a real hot pursuit was not possible. Bond has done everything perfect. Her Majesty the Queen will be completely satisfied and she will praise him. And now, at the end, we should think at the beginning. If Kalashnikova had not used a car, maybe the story would have had another ending. Such a special one, as it is typical for James Bond films.